They give me extra mana regeneration. And the, uh, the hand wraps. She looks pretty cool. Um, just to try some different kinds of um, combat. Let's see. Okay, fire damage. That's pretty cool. Damn, look at this. <laughs> see, that's pretty cool. That's what I'm talking about. I wish Skyrim had staves, but it didn't. Yeah, what up, spider? What up? I'm a mage. It's pretty cool. I think I'm gonna go magic with this game because it seems really interesting. He uses staves and stuff. It looks like like it's really cool. So I'll, I'll try using it. They're very vulnerable to magic. Ooh, what's this? A mushroom I can loot? Oh, it's a spider sack. Ew. Old shoes, some bones and stuff. I'm just gonna take it all because I still can. Let's see, old shoes, they give extra mana. Why don't I equip them? Ew, they have like sandals, that doesn't look very, very dangerous, but okay, I'll, I'll use it. Anything else I missed? Don't think so, let's keep going. So, okay, so far, I, this is pretty cool. I'm really looking forward to the full game, because this game seems amazing. From what I've seen so far, it's like, a huge world, filled with... All sorts of RPG -y stuff, which I love. I'll leave the Well of Souls. And after I finished Skyrim, I didn't really find an, uh, like a new RPG to play. Hurry, get out of here. Why would you say that to me? It's not very friendly. Let's break some stuff. Hey, gold. So you don't like physically s see the gold. You just sort of get it. After destroying it. That doesn't make sense, but that's the way it is. Hey. Oh, is that an... Ooh. Some gold. Damn, I'm big compared to these little fellas. Okay. Okay. Um, I need more help. Oh, is that like persuasion? Let's try it. I suppose yes! To help if the Tuatha realize what you are. I don't know what he gave me. Oh, some potions. Okay. I can fight with you. We can't risk you getting killed. You're proof that the well can work. Don't you realize what that means? I'm the chosen one. Just keep going past the top of the well. Hughes will be there in his study. Hughes. I'll see you on the outside. Okay. Uh, let's see if there's anything more I can find. Pretty cool, the persuasion, too. That's seems interesting. What's in here? That's just normal armor, but I'll take it. Any more weapon, weapon wrecks? Some more daggers, some more armor. I'll just take all of it. I can probably sell it. Old shoes, torn ropes. It's all the same stuff I already found. That's too bad. Probably if you, if you like miss anything, but I don't think that's even possible. Because you had to pick up everything for... Oh, whatever. Again, there's a bunch of people I can talk to, but that will take time, and I think the demo is timed. So let's try and get to use and, and, and see what he has to say. Wow. I mean, graphically, this game looks pretty awesome, I have to say. It's really my style. By clicking R. Oh, it's not really... It just changes the viewpoint, I guess. Okay, cool. Good to know. I should probably not jump in there. Is there anything... Ah, oh, I see a book. Well, progress log. So if you're actually interested in, like, the, um, the story behind the, uh, the game, you can read all of that. But I'm not going to do it in the demo, like I said. Because that would take pretty long. I don't want to come across as some, some like Call of Duty kid that's not interested in stories or whatever, or RPGs, but I want to try and, and um, just get through the demo as, like, as far as I can. When using daggers, you trade power and reach for speed and precision. This makes daggers highly effective against a single target. That makes sense. Oh god, I was drinking! Okay. Whatever, I'm good. I'm good. Oh, here we go. 
use. Turn from the dead? Please forgive me. You must be terribly confused by all of this. I am Fomorous Hughes, and this is my laboratory at Alistar. Everything you see here is dedicated to one thing, the well of souls, the pursuit of immortality. And you, you're my first success. If we only had the time, there's so much we might learn from one another. Um, hey, uh, what's, uh, what's going on? Too much to explain right now. The Tuatha have come to stop my work, but I don't believe they know about you. Not yet. What's important is getting you out of here safely. You're the only proof of what we've achieved here. I may not be able to save the well, but I can ensure that its only success is safe. Okay, so where are we? Let's get out of here. I'll stay and fight. I've got more questions. I'll stay and fight, maybe? Absolutely not. I've got my notes, but it's most important that you stay safe. It's just that you... you're... Oh God, what is going on? Fascinating. Simply astounding. I'm not certain what's caused it, but somehow... Uh, yes, as That I door said, behind I'm him. I'm not sure what... Oh no! Wow. Damn, this actually... Wow. That was a good... Wow. I'm just pretty amazed at the story so far. It, it's very interesting. Uh, seriously. Like, I really want to read all those books and see what's going on because my character is like... Uh, lost his memory, so I want to know more about the story. Like, what is going on exactly? So they made a well that can turn people back to life, and obviously bad people want that power, but... Um, so they can abuse it, and we're going to stop them. It's, it doesn't come across as sort of like an entirely a new story, like, oh god, I've never seen anything like this, but so far I have to say it feels pretty badass. Hey, screw you. Yeah, that's right. Boom. Here you go. I haven't died yet. I haven't had to use a potion, so I guess I'm doing okay. Some coins, some lockpicks, pretty okay-ish. Okay, let's keep going. We, we need not to die. We need to not die. I don't know. I don't even know what I'm saying. Oh, a potion. Thanks, bro. Or are you a girl? Are you a girl? No, it's a, it's a dwarf. It's a little gnome. Oh, is this a boss fight? Looks like it. Yup. What? Why did it... Why did it have subtitles, like, saying that? Doesn't make sense. Oh, God! Okay, so he has that stupid branch, whatever the hell it is. That, like, a whole tree? What the fuck? Boom, there you go, buddy. What you gonna do? What you gonna do? You gonna hit me? You gonna hit me? You gonna hit me? Her Magic, go! Oh, God. That was close. Screw you. Stupid troll. Oh, what the hell? He's got ranged attacks? That doesn't make sense to me. Ouch. Help me. What? How does he shoot stuff at me? Does he just, like, smash a bunch of rocks at me? That's not nice. How does he resist this? Okay, I'll drink some mana. Crap. Crap. What you gonna do? 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 That's right. Yeah, that's right. I can dodge. 
I can dodge. I just figured out how to do it. Boom! Yeah, what's up, buddy? What's up with you? Yeah, that's right. Oh, God. Oh, shit. That's a... Wow. So we get extra experience for do killing him in that way. That's pretty crazy. I'm sorry, you didn't have to die that... <gasps> a ring. Sweet. Some coins. A shard can be used for sage crafting. Sounds like another way to say enchanting, but okay. Let's see, torn robes. They do the exact same thing, so there's no real use in me picking another one to, to use. Um, how about weapons? Did I pick up something new? Oh, just a daggers. Uh, oh, extra health. I'll take it. Yeah, that's pretty useful. Consumables. Oh, I already have a bunch of potions, so I'll just drink that one. And a few new items. Okay, there we go. That's that's a troll's dead. That was pretty pretty cool. That was actually a pretty good boss fight. Talismans provide less protection from physical attacks and a kite shooter buckler, but they greatly increase your resistance to elemental damage. Hmm. Sounds interesting. So they they use those to block against magic. Oh, there's more dead gnomes everywhere. Hey, I leveled up. Okay, so I can now pick level up. What's the next new quest? Into the light. He told me to find this fate weaver named Egerth. This is going to be interesting. Level up. Let's do it. Oh, I get one point for this. Hmm. Okay, so I already have two points in lockpicking when I'm mercantile. I want to detect hidden because of my race. And then I can pick a new one. Like alchemy. I guess you can pick whatever you want, but... Persuasion? To persuade others to your way of thinking. I always like persuasion. Quality shards. I don't even know what that exactly does. Mercantile. Gold costs, blah, blah, blah. So, if there's a marking, you get, like, a special perk, and otherwise just, like, oh, this increases or that increases. Stealth, I'm not gonna do that. Um, alchemy, maybe? Oh, they create potions. It doesn't seem like, you know, a lot of fun. Hidden treasures are displayed on the mini-map. Okay, let's go with that one. Why not? Confirm. Oh, we also get three points for this. Extra damage with staves, or scepters, or... Charge special attacks for the staff. Yeah, let's go with that one. I know I want to do more damage with them. And I want to upgrade my, my spell that I have. And now I have a new move. We have... I should probably go to the staves option thingy. Thingamabob. Charge. Hold down your attack button and you can... Wow. Damn, that's badass. Holy shit. Okay. Well, that, you know, settles that. There's a bunch of people I could talk to, probably get some new quests, They're like, oh, God, my wife is dead, I need medicine, you know, some stuff like that. I think the green thing is probably treasure. Let's follow it and see where it leads. Oh, what's this? Shrine? What does it do? A bonus. Help get this thing away from me. So someone's getting attacked over here. I see a red dot, so it could be... Ooh, loot. Oh, harvest. What the hell is this? A bear? Stop it, bear! Oh, you're not a bear. You're not a normal-looking bear. You're like a weird Disney bear. Oh, that's that poor bear. Oh, that's that guy. You're the one. How did you come back? How did you find me here? Oh, I heard you screaming. Did you know about the attack? What are you doing here? Did you know about the attack? Dear anything like that would happen. The Well of Souls is bigger than one gnome's pet project. My employer pays for information about its progress. I just send reports to make some money on the side. I never wanted anyone to get hurt. Pay me and you'll live. Yes, yeah, give me money. I don't, I don't have. Okay. Here. It's all I've got. Plus what I got paid for the Oh, yeah, give me that money. I don't want any part of this. I'm going home to Odessa. Okay, so I got some free gold for not bribing, but blackmailing just a little gnome. Okay, so this is the first area. It looks pretty intriguing. 
Reminds me of like the night night elf areas in World of Warcraft. No reagents found, so you can pick plants and then get stuff. Um, hey, which you can use in alchemy probably. Are these wolves? Hey, wolf! Suck my butt. That's right. You're not. You're not. Some, oh, jeez. Damn it, dude. Quite a bit of damage, actually. I'm getting out of this place. Oh, God. I'm not the best at the combat yet. Oh, he just... So... Boom! There you go, buddy. Yeah, who's the wolf now? Who's the wolf now? So, let's see. There's around the corner here. There's some treasure. Lots of reagents to find. I'm really interested to see what you can do with all those... Things are some hidden treasure down here or somewhere. Oh, see, there we go. Some bark. I don't even know what it. Oh, that's just like a special reagent, I guess. Okay, let's follow the road. Who are you? Oh, that's the guy I blackmailed into giving me his money. Ooh. Damn, that sword. Jeez. Who the hell is this guy? Oh, Agarth. Name's Agar. Maybe you can help an old fate weaver, eh? Uh, you you sent me to find you. Did he? Poor old Fomerus Hughes. He respected the way the world works. What a shame. He's probably dead. <laughs> wow. Okay, what do you know about him? What makes you think he's dead? The cards told me that the Well of Souls would work. But Hughes' success would come on the day of his death. Seriously, the cards? He took it pretty well, honestly. Although we did a lot of drinking after that. Okay, can you give me some help? I oh, I man! Could, times are tough. I've barely got enough to pay my bar tabs as it is. You douche. Uh, it's okay, I was dead too. You? You're the one. Then that means it all makes sense now. The cards this morning. I drew the Grave Digger, the Running Man, and the Beast. Prepare yourself. They're coming. Okay, screw you and your cards. I'm not here to talk about stupid cards. I'm here to kick ass and chew bubblegum. I don't know what that means, but I... Perform special attacks and defeat enemies to gather threats of fate energy. Okay, what does it do, though? Riddle me that, Batman. Our assassins now. Rogue. We're rogue. Freezer, you lost your fate shift in it. I'm holding it. I'm holding it. And now I am. Wow, I'm a real badass now. I get special finishing moves. Oh, jeez. Ah. Ouch. Give me that bonus experience. Damn, that must hurt. Look, wow. That was awesome. Okay. What? How? What are you? I'm a beast. The threads of fate. I've seen them before, but I've never seen anyone manipulate them like that. Oh, you know, I'm pretty, just pretty dangerous. The world was supposed to work. How did you do that? Uh, I don't know. I just did it. I just did it because I'm a pro. MLG. Fate is the will of the gods. No mortal should be able to change it. How is that even possible? Come here. I'm going to do a reading. You might be able to change the threads, but fate will still have a plan for you. I promise not to tell you if I see your dead. I'd rather not. Is this why he sent me? That would be my guess. He was an academic, but he had a proper respect for fate's plan, unlike most gnomes. Hey, don't be racist, man. Okay, fine. Show me my fate. You're nervous. Relax. This is what fate we. I'm not even speaking. I'm just. I'll be seeing your place in the pattern of destiny. Who you are, what you've done, where your path takes you, or at least I should be. You're real, right? I swear, I haven't had that much. You can't... S I'm real, you must be drunk. I am. <laughs> what the hell? 
never seen someone whose fate was just missing. Not even when I was drunk as the King of Ballads. This doesn't make sense. All mortal creatures have a place in the pattern. You should have one too, dead or not. Maybe I'm the one making the pattern. If this is true, and I'm not saying I believe it, then your path is yours to do. Uh, yes it is. Ooh. Okay, so unlocked destinies. Fateless one. Newly resurrected, your fate is blank. Formless and ready to be forced into the shape of your choosing. We've got Rogue. Unlike many of the warriors of Amalur, rogues prefer to fight from far away or from behind. <laughs> she said. Or by dishonorable means, and usually by surprise. The rogue, you sneak, dodge, and sled their weapons with poison to gain the advantage in combat. Gives you extra range attack damage, piercing damage, and damage resistance while dodging. We have the Brawler. With this destiny, you are a formidable melee combatant. You can withstand a lot of punishment and is, it is usually more efficient for you to block or suffer an attack rather than dodge one. So extra melee attack damage and block efficiency. And we have the Acolyte. As an Acolyte, you are devoted to the arcane and the mastery of elemental forces. You prefer to destroy your opponents with raw magic rather than through crude or mundane methods. Plus 50% elemental damage and plus 10% uh, I mean 10 mana cost reduction. Okay, that's interesting. Expand. Oh, and then you can later upgrade even more. Ooh, that's pretty cool. Initiate Seer Sage, and then you can be a Sorcerer. If you have, like, a lot of skill points into one of the trees. So I'm gonna go with the magic one for now. Uh, Acolyte, there we go. Confirm.